Hey Ninjago fan, this is League of J, and in this video we're going to be discussing the newly revealed set images of some of the Ninjago crystallized sets. Now these sets were not revealed by LEGO yet, however some of them were revealed by some online retailers. So let's start off with Nia's Samurai X mech. Now we got this first look at this in a trailer, which is going to make a video about some in the near future. But this mech is no joke. It's definitely the tallest Ninjago mech, as was rumored. Um, we get Nia as normal, like as the actual person, you know, with the yellow minifigure face. She's not the water. So that's something worth pointing out. With the mechanic in here, we have Jay, and um, we have Pythor. And we have Nelson. He doesn't really appear to be like have a ninja, so per se, but he has this kind of cap and hood combination, kind of like Scott. Um, and there's an Overlord or Crystal, small old dragon, I guess you could call it. That's supposed to be fighting the mech. And this mech just looks super awesome. Um, also. I uh, forgot to mention that Master Wu comes in this set with kind of what looks like to be like the hero armor from season 13. And so all in all, this set looks pretty cool. Um, something else worth mentioning is Jay's, or you could say the crystal version of Jay's um, nunchucks. Because in a lot of the sets, they have four weapons, but they're used by the villains. And they have crystal on it, kind of like possessed, I guess you could say. But all in all, this set looks very, very awesome. And can't wait to see the actual set images revealed by LEGO. Although it looks like most of these pictures are, or at least most of the pictures that are going to be revealed by LEGO. Now the next set we're going to be taking a look at, it's not such high quality, but it's... Lloyd's Golden Ultra Dragon. So in this set, you get Lloyd in what people are calling the uh, Oni form of Lloyd. You get the four original ninja. You have the Crystal King or the Overlord, as people think he is. Um, you have the Ultra Dragon, and apparently, like the ninja, could transform into the dragon. We have to exactly see what that's about, but yeah, his dragon looks pretty cool all in all. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about it. Now the next set we're going to be taking a look at is the Crystal King, which is some kind of centaur, as we referred. We have Lloyd and Harumi, and possibly... Crystal King in here. I'm not exactly sure what that figure is. Um, it probably is him. But it's a pretty interesting looking uh, mech or centaur. I don't know. It kind of looks like at the front. It kind of looks like a mech. But it's apparently a centaur. Looks pretty menacing. Um, yeah, there's a lot of crystal all over the place. Um, yeah, it's holding a big crystal sword. It's a claw on the other hand. Yeah, this Crystal King set looks pretty cool, all things considered. The next set we're going to be taking a look at is a Crystal King Temple set. Um, this set has a few pictures, kind of like the Samurai X mech, and high quality also. So, as we've heard in the set images description, um, there's four platforms, or really three platforms. Um, I guess I'll, I'll get four platforms, but yeah, the four weapons, um, and the ninja trying to get to them, and you have some kind of traps. Um, you see in the back of the box, there's some traps, the steps fall, um, things shoot out, um, some kind of jail that you could fall into. Um, but all in all, this thing is pretty cool. You have the Crystal King, it looks to be on a throne on the top. A little mini 
crystal dragon, I guess you could say. Um, you have a crystal samurai, and you have the four original ninja included. And taking a closer look at the four original ninja, I have to say, this might be one of my favorite ninja uniforms. They're like core, but just much better. I think that the similar decor in that they have uh, some kind of like designs on the these little shapes, I guess you could say, or dots on the front of the torso. And also the masks are kind of similar. I guess for certain ninjas, but just in general, these ninja look amazing. And I can't wait to get my hands on them in the upcoming sets. The next set we're going to be taking a look at is Zane's Golden Dragon Jet. Now this is the first set to be revealed, but this picture is a lot higher quality. See more the details. Yeah, this jet looks pretty cool. Um, if you take a closer look at like the stickers on it, or maybe the printed pieces, you see some interesting designs. Um, on the window, you see kind of like Zane um, in a wing form on the windscreen, like a sticker. Like that's probably controls. I'm curious to see what that's all about. Um, you have Cole in his golden dragon form. You have the skull stressor. Um, yeah, I guess we already got a, a first look at the set before, but these sets images are a lot higher quality. And yeah, it looks pretty cool, all things considered. And I can't wait to see see it even more. The next set we're going to be taking a look at is Kai's Golden Dragon Raider. And this set looks pretty cool. Some may say it looks like a bit of a mess. I think it's pretty cool. Um, a lot of gold and red on it. And I wonder if actually all the vehicles uh, go together somehow. That would be pretty cool. Anyways, um, the figures we get Zane in his Golden Dragon form. You have Kai. We have Skylar, um, and we have Mr. E with the crystal armor. And all in all, this set looks pretty cool. The last set we're going to be taking a look at is Jay's Golden Dragon motorbike. And I think this one one of my favorite like vehicles from this wave. I mean, you have Jay in his Golden Dragon form. The golden dragon forms of the ninja look pretty awesome, I have to say. Um, you have a crystal samurai. It's a small little set, probably twenty dollars. I'm guessing, I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, this looks like a pretty cool bike, and I can't wait to see more pictures and clearer pictures revealed by Lego. And in general, this wave is looking awesome. I can't wait to see more and the actual real pictures from Lego. And I'm really looking forward to these sets. And when LEGO reveals more pictures and higher quality, then I will talk about them in a different video. But for now, these sandwiches look amazing. It's one of the best plays ever from Ninjago, if not the best. And yeah, I'm blown away by this wave. It's amazing. And that'll pretty much be it for this video today. Just wanted to discuss some of the newly revealed set images and when lego reveals the rest of them we'll talk about more in a different video but yeah that'll pretty much be it for this video so please like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos coming soon peace <laughs>